On the quiet morning of January 14th, the universe stirred in ways that would soon captivate the scientific community. Out there, in the vast and uncharted expanses of space, something was moving. Something that had, until recently, gone largely unnoticed. This was no ordinary celestial body. It was an object known to scientists as Three-Eye Atlas, an interstellar wanderer travelling through the emptiness of our solar system. It was the kind of object that could easily slip through our understanding, unseen, unnoticed, and perhaps misunderstood. At first glance, it seemed like just another comet. These icy visitors to our solar system are common enough. They come from the distant reaches of space, their frozen forms carrying the remnants of the early solar system. But Three Atlas was different. There was something about it that made astronomers sit up and take notice. Its irregular movements, its bright appearance, even from such a great distance, everything about it defied the usual behaviour of a typical comet. Astronomers had first observed Three Atlas back in 2017, when it was just a faint dot in the sky, far beyond the reach of most telescopes. They had assumed it was yet another comet on its way through the outer reaches of our solar system. Its appearance seemed standard at first, following the expected path of a comet, a faint trail behind it as it barreled through the cosmos. But this assumption would soon be shattered as the object began to exhibit strange behaviours. Its brightness increased unexpectedly, making it visible to observers who had been following its movements. Comets don't usually shine with such intensity unless they are nearing the sun, and Three Atlas wasn't near any star. So what was causing this unusual glow? The first signs of its peculiar nature came in the form of strange brightness fluctuations. Unlike typical comets, which brighten as they approach the sun due to the release of gas and dust from their icy cores, Three-Eye Atlas was becoming brighter long before it should have. What made this even stranger was that it was not emitting a typical cometary tail, the gaseous and dusty plume that forms when a comet's core starts to vaporise as it nears the sun. Instead, it appeared as though something more complex was happening. It had an aura around it, a glow that didn't quite fit the typical pattern. Scientists were puzzled. Was it reflecting sunlight? Was it radiating light on its own? Or was there another cause entirely for its increased luminosity? As the months passed, the mystery of Three-Eye Atlas deepened. What had initially seemed like a comet passing through the solar system soon began to appear as something far more intriguing. Observations from ground-based telescopes and space observatories like Hubble began to show an object whose behaviour didn't align with the usual dynamics of comets or asteroids. And with each new image, astronomers began to realise that they were dealing with something far more enigmatic, an object that might just hold the key to answering questions about the nature of the universe itself. The idea that Three Atlas could be something far more complex than a simple comet was beginning to take hold. Its brightness and behaviour suggested it was not just a chunk of ice and dust, but rather something with a much more intricate and perhaps even exotic composition. What had started as a simple observation of an interstellar visitor was slowly transforming into a major scientific puzzle, one that could shake our understanding of the cosmos. And so, through a key eye, Atlas drifted through the vast emptiness, a solitary traveller from the far reaches of space. Every new image, every new observation seemed to raise more questions than answers. Was it a comet, an asteroid, or something entirely different? How had it travelled so far across the galaxy to reach our solar system? Was it even from our galaxy at all? Or had it travelled through the intergalactic void from another star system? The answers were just out of reach, waiting to be uncovered by the very instruments designed to explore the unknown. As astronomers continued to observe and study Three-Eye Atlas, they couldn't help but wonder, what did this strange interstellar object truly represent? Was it a remnant of some ancient cosmic event? a survivor of a long-forgotten collision between distant stars? Or was it something entirely new, a phenomenon that we had never encountered before? Whatever it was, one thing became clear. Three-Eye Atlas was no ordinary object. It was a messenger from the farthest reaches of space, and its journey through our solar system would challenge everything we thought we knew about the universe. On the morning of January 11th, the astronomical world was poised in eager anticipation. For weeks, scientists had been tracking Three-Eye Atlas, trying to piece together the mysteries of this strange interstellar object that had suddenly appeared in our solar system. Though many of the initial observations had been puzzling, 
They had yet to offer any definitive answers. There was a sense of urgency, a belief that the breakthrough they were waiting for was just around the corner. That breakthrough came unexpectedly when the Hubble Space Telescope captured a stunning image of 3 Eye Atlas, an image that would change everything. The Hubble Telescope, a beacon of clarity and precision in the exploration of space, had provided some of the most remarkable images of our universe. Yet nothing could have prepared the scientific community for what they were about to see. The image that emerged from Hubble's lenses that morning revealed Three Eye Atlas in a way no one had expected. For the first time, the object was shown in vivid detail, its features sharper and more defined than ever before. The high resolution of the image allowed scientists to see the object as never before, presenting a view of Three Eye Atlas that challenged the assumptions that had been made about it in the past. As the image was released, the reaction was immediate and intense. Astronomers, researchers and space enthusiasts alike stared at the image, each trying to make sense of the new data. What they saw was an object unlike any other comet or asteroid previously observed. The first thing that stood out was its irregular shape, far from the typical smooth elliptical form that characterizes most celestial bodies of its kind. Three Eye Atlas appeared to be fragmented, with jagged edges and an uneven surface. This was no ordinary interstellar wanderer, something was clearly different about it. As researchers pored over the image, another striking detail emerged. Three Eye Atlas was glowing in a way that had never been seen before. The image showed the object emitting a soft, almost ethereal light, a faint but unmistakable glow that surrounded its core. It wasn't a flare from the sun, nor was it simply a reflection of starlight. There was something intrinsic to Three Eye Atlas that was making it shine. Could it be emitting its own light? Was it producing energy in a way that no comet had before? The question of what caused this unique glow became a primary focus for scientists, as it opened up new avenues of inquiry into the behaviour of objects in deep space. The Hubble image also revealed a hazy, diffuse aura around Three Eye Atlas, but it wasn't quite the tail that scientists had expected to see. Typically, comets form long, sweeping tails made up of gas and dust as they approach the sun, but Three Eye Atlas didn't show such a tail. Instead, the object was surrounded by a faint, nebulous cloud that seemed to defy explanation. Was this an indication of something unique about its composition, or was it a result of some unknown force acting upon the object as it travelled through the vast emptiness of space? Whatever the cause, this haze suggested that Three Eye Atlas was not just another simple cosmic body. It was something far more complex. For weeks, the object had been brighter than expected, but the Hubble image now confirmed that this brightness wasn't just a fleeting illusion. There was something at the core of Three Eye Atlas that was producing an incredible amount of light. But what was it? Was this a typical phenomenon, or was this a glimpse into something completely new? With every passing hour, the object seemed to grow more enigmatic, its behaviour increasingly difficult to explain through the current understanding of space science. Astronomers now began to consider the possibility that Three Eye Atlas was not just an interstellar comet, but something entirely different. Was it an asteroid, a rogue planet, or even a fragment of a much larger cosmic structure? The sharpness and detail of the Hubble image only deepened the mystery, providing more questions than answers. Scientists theorised that this object could be a remnant of a long-destroyed celestial body, a shattered fragment from an ancient collision. But the more they analysed the data, the more they realised that Three Eye Atlas wasn't just a remnant. It could be a key to understanding the forces that shape the universe itself. For some, the image from Hubble felt like a revelation, a moment of insight that could unlock new chapters in the story of the cosmos. For others, it raised even more profound questions. The scientific community now had a new challenge before them. To decode the mysteries hidden in this stunning image and understand the true nature of Three Eye Atlas. This was more than just another object passing through our solar system. It was a puzzle, a riddle left by the cosmos, one that demanded answers. The Hubble image had revealed something extraordinary, and the journey to uncover the truth was just beginning. The Hubble Space Telescope had given us a glimpse into the unknown, and with this newfound knowledge, the story of Three Eye Atlas was now forever entwined with the quest for discovery in the vastness of space. In the early stages of observing Three Eye Atlas, one of the most striking features that caught the attention of astronomers was its unexpected brightness. Comets, as we know them, 
tend to exhibit a predictable behaviour as they approach the sun. The ice and dust within a comet's core begin to vaporise due to the sun's heat, creating a glowing coma and often a trailing tail of gas and dust. However, 3i Atlas didn't follow this expected pattern. It began to brighten long before it reached the inner part of the solar system, and this unusual phenomenon immediately raised questions. Initially, scientists believed that the brightness could be due to the object's reflective surface, but the data didn't quite add up. Normally, objects like comets reflect sunlight, but the way 3i Atlas was shining was different. Its glow was not simply a reflection of sunlight, it seemed to be emitting its own light in a way that was completely unexpected. Some researchers considered the possibility that 3i Atlas was releasing gas and dust from its surface as it warmed up, but even then, the f brightness was still more intense than what would be expected from a typical comet in this stage of its journey. Could there be something else at play? This brightness raised a question that had not been asked before in the context of interstellar objects. What if 3i Atlas wasn't just reflecting sunlight but actually generating energy from within? This idea was intriguing because it would suggest a different composition for the object, perhaps a material that could somehow harness or store energy from the cosmos around it. What if the object was emitting light through some natural process that wasn't yet understood? Was it possible that 3i Atlas could be a fragment of a much larger celestial body, one that had once been part of a star system with completely different physical characteristics? The idea that an object could produce its own light without the influence of the sun or nearby stars would challenge our understanding of interstellar bodies. For astronomers, this new puzzle sparked a flurry of activity. With every new observation, the intensity of 3 Atlas's brightness only seemed to grow. It was as if the object was not simply reflecting light, but actively interacting with the space around it, in ways that were still not entirely clear. As the data came in from multiple observatories and telescopes, scientists began to propose several theories. Perhaps the object contained materials that were highly reflective, like certain metals or minerals, that could explain its unusual shine. Others speculated that the object might be undergoing a chemical reaction on its surface, one that was producing light as a byproduct. But the most intriguing theory was the idea that 3i Atlas might be emitting energy from within, a process that could be completely new to science. One theory that gained traction was that the brightness could be attributed to the presence of a high-energy reaction occurring deep within the object. In some cases, celestial bodies such as comets or asteroids can experience internal heating from radioactivity, but this was thought to be a rare occurrence. Could 3i Atlas be somehow radiating this kind of internal energy, amplifying its glow? As scientists delved deeper into the object's characteristics, it became clear that it was not just another comet passing through our solar system. It was something much more complicated, an object that was rewriting the rules of what astronomers thought they knew about interstellar visitors. The object's brightness also brought to light a broader question about the nature of objects that travel through space. Was 3i Atlas a one-of-a-kind object, or were there other interstellar bodies out there that could exhibit similar behaviour? If this object could shine so brightly without the influence of a star, what else in the universe could be doing the same thing, and what could that mean for our understanding of cosmic processes? Scientists began to realise that the true mystery of 3 Atlas might lie not just in its composition, but in its very existence. Could it be that objects like this were far more common than we initially thought, and that we had simply never had the tools to detect them before? One key piece of the puzzle was the object's location. 3i Atlas was not travelling close enough to the sun for it to be experiencing significant solar radiation, yet it was exhibiting brightness similar to that of objects close to the inner solar system. It was as if the object was producing its own energy, relying on something other than the sun for its glow. Could it be that this object was from a part of the galaxy where stars behave in ways we don't fully understand yet, or perhaps it came from a system with unique environmental conditions? The question seemed endless, and the more data that poured in, the more complicated the mystery became. What was most intriguing about 3i Atlas was that its brightness wasn't just an oddity, it seemed to defy our conventional understanding of how objects behave in the cosmos. And as scientists continued to study it, they began to wonder, could this object, with its baffling brightness and mysterious origins, be a harbinger of something even greater lurking just beyond our reach? 
something that could reveal secrets about the universe that we hadn't yet even begun to imagine. Every piece of new data seemed to offer just enough information to deepen the mystery, and with every new revelation, the excitement grew. Three Atlas had proven to be no ordinary visitor to our solar system. It was an enigma, one that would continue to challenge and excite the minds of astronomers for years to come. One of the most iconic features of comets is their tail, a brilliant sweeping arc of gas, dust and particles that stretches out behind them as they draw near the sun. This glowing tail is a direct result of the sun's heat, which causes the comet's icy core to sublimate, releasing gas and dust into space. Yet, when astronomers turned their attention to Three-Eye Atlas, something remarkable caught their eye. It didn't have the familiar tail of a typical comet. Instead, it seemed to be surrounded by a faint, diffuse aura, unlike anything they had observed before. At first, this presented a puzzle. Comets typically exhibit distinct tails, but Three-Eye Atlas appeared to lack one altogether. Some researchers speculated that the object might simply be too distant from the sun to form a traditional tail, but this didn't quite explain the haze that surrounded the object. Unlike the solid, visible tails seen in other comets, this aura didn't consist of the usual gas and dust emissions. Instead, it seemed to be a hazy, translucent glow, as if Three-Eye Atlas was shedding something altogether different, something that didn't behave like the typical cometary gas. Could it be that Three-Eye Atlas was composed of entirely different materials, or was its behaviour being influenced by a force we didn't yet? Understand? The absence of a tail made this already enigmatic object even more mysterious. 